Okay, uh, hello. Uh, what I'm going to show you now is uh, how to use Sopcast for normal Windows based PCs. Now, I've shown you how to do it on the Mac, which is here on my other video, but this one will show you how to do it on a Windows based PC. It's almost identical except the Sopcast program is ever so slightly different. Um, we do everything exactly as we did before uh, in terms of uh, finding the links. Uh, so, what we've got here is we're typing in Sopcast. Streams. Ooh, struggling to Sopcast. No, nope. Sopcast streams. And just as we did before, we go to the first result. Uh, uh, live football. Lol. TV. I guess it is. Dot TV. Um, so yeah, this will take us uh, to a list of different links and stuff. Uh, we want to get the Man United Liverpool game, which is on right now. Uh, so we scroll down. Uh, as I said, it's got a list of games that are yet to come uh, come up, games that have already been played. We just basically need to find the live one. Right now, Liverpool and Manchester United is live, as we're watching here. It's one all. Uh, so res. Um, so, uh, yeah, okay, so we find Liverpool and Man United. We know that's happening live. Click on that. And it takes us to another list here. Again, you've got a choice of different links here. Uh, I think the EN here stands for English uh, English links. So these three are probably being broadcast in English. This is NL. I don't know what country that is. This is probably Russia. I don't know what that is. God knows what the hell the others are. Canadian, perhaps, or Taiwan. Yeah. But whatever. Uh, we were after this link here, the one that says Blood Seed. That's a good link. So we click on that. And this page opens. And again, just as before, we want this link here. Uh, again, on its own, it's useless without the program. But we right-click, copy link address. Now what we need to do is we, op we need to open up Sopcast. So we click that, we go to Sopcast. Now Sopcast for Windows is available, install it. Once installed, uh, run it. You'll get this window that comes up. Login is anonymous, that's fine. Login. And it'll start to boot up in a second. Right click on it, it's freezing there a little bit. Okay, so it logs in. What you've got here is you've got this little window that opens here. Now, um, at the top here where it says address, delete what's there, and we're going to paste our link. Right click, paste, uh, and then we click this arrow here. And this little window opens up here and it starts to buffer. Now, the buffer it's this right here, and in a second it should start buffering up. Now the problem is I've got this lit game running here on the side, so it might be awfully slow. Find out in a sec, really. 4% now. I don't know how clearly you guys can see that. It's on 4%. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to close this one here. So this one might be able to speed up. There you go. Now it's waking up. 16... Okay, so we just wait basically for that to buffer up. Let's get the sound on a bit. Uh, oh, something's happening already. Sound off a bit. 36%. Okay, just thinking about doing something there. Oh, bollocks, it's crashed. I know it hasn't. Okay, now this game comes up. Liverpool down to zero. I'll just click on this to expand it, and there we go. There you go. And that's how you get it. Uh, you can do the same thing with other other links. It's almost identical. It's just the uh, it's just the inter uh, you can do the same with the other games and stuff uh, from all over the world. Uh, very similar to the Mac uh, tutorial. Uh, but yeah. You just basically need the Sopcast links. As long as someone's providing, you just copy those links, paste them in Sopcast, and away you go. And that's how you get it to work. Uh, thanks for watching.